Uzi da Maidan kamadim bu army fire me kadan. When we got to the airport, uh, they were shooting some air, air uh, sh shooting in the air to the disrupt people, and they said that I told my kids they're not going to shoot us. Just lay down on the ground and uh, let them do their things, and then uh, the things will clear. Then we will go to the where we want to go. People were uh, like us who made it to the airport and then to the plane were very happy thinking about the bright future but also uh, looking at the, looking back to the country they were making them sad and because they lost everything the, the, the country was in chaos and uh, a dark days was coming my kids were scared they were telling me every time let's go home we don't want to go there uh, i was scared myself uh, i didn't want to show it out to my kids so uh, I will bring down their um, moral, but at the end I was like thinking, you know, uh, we might get hurt, it would be a little hard to get there, but, you know, we will have, we have a future. Uh, I was worried about my daughters, myself, and especially my husband. If anything happened to my husband, who will support us? What will happen if one of our family get killed or, or they come after us? That would be devastating. We have a very sad feeling. We lost everything we achieved in the last 20 years. And I don't think there is a hope. I don't, I don't, people are uh, panicked, they are shocked. You know, they, don't, they don't think that there will be future for, for Afghanistan.